Today I'm going to talk about cold hands. Many people feel as though their hands are cold, they have a cold sensation in their hands, and they ask me why. There's two big buckets for the reasons. Option number one, it's poor circulation to the hands and to the fingers. I'm going to talk about all the reasons for that. Option number two, the hands aren't really cold, but there's actually a sensation as if the hands are cold. I'm going to talk about that later. Let's start with the poor circulation. Why would there be poor circulation to the, uh, to the fingers? Well, option number one is because there's a problem with the blood flowing or pumping into the fingers. That could be, for example, because there's a problem with the heart pump or if the blood pressure is low either because it is low because of a disease or because of medication so if the heart pump isn't pumping enough or if the blood pressure is low then effectively not enough blood will reach the hands or uh, or the fingers and you will feel a cold sensation option number two anemia not enough blood if there's not enough blood again effectively it won't be enough to warm the hands and the fingers Option number three is that the metabolism itself is slowed down. The most classic is, example is when the thyroid hormone is, is in insufficient amounts. If you have hypothyroidism, not enough of that hormone, your metabolism is going to slow down. You won't have enough effective warming of your hands and fingers. Again, you're going to have a cold sensation. The next option is that there's not enough blood flowing into the hand or fingers because the arteries are constricted. If it is reversible, that's often called Raynaud's. We made a separate video about that. You can check it out. Option number two, the blood flow to the hands and fingers uh, is diminished in a fixed way. It's constant because the arteries are damaged. Why would they be damaged? Well, examples include occupational hazards like using a jackhammer chronically or because of inflammation in the finger arteries, but there are other reasons as well. Now, after that, it could be that not enough blood is reaching the hands and the fingers because of blocked uh, arteries in these locations. Why would the arteries be blocked? So blood clots may come from the heart or from other arteries and block blood flow to the hands and fingers. Again, then they will feel uh, cold. The next option is that blood clots will form in the fingers themselves, either one finger or several fingers. Again, uh, that would prevent blood from reaching the hands and the fingers and that will result in a cold sensation. So all those were reasons for cold hands because of poor circulation. But sometimes, even often, you may feel a cold sensation in your hands when your hands aren't actually cold. That is because the sensation comes from the nerves and the nerves may fire, they sense as if there's a cold sensation when it's not really there. That happens when the nerves are damaged. And the most typical example is neuropathy or peripheral neuropathy. Obviously, the classic is, example is diabetes, but there are many other reasons for that. Finally, your hands may be cold just because you're not warming them up uh, enough. It could be that your cold sensation in your hands is normal and typical, and it could just be that you're exposed to the cold environment and you need to use better hand warming with uh, mittens, hand warmers, etc. So to summarize, cold hands can be because of poor circulation for all the reasons we said, it can be because of problem with the nerves, or it can be because of cold exposure and not enough warming with clothing.